Hey, what's up, you guys? Oh, man, I have some thoughts on my head. Some heavy. Let's get this lighting right. Oh, I'm fucking it up. My kitchen is it's bright. But anyways, I have some thoughts, man. I just want to share with you guys. Anybody else out there? Um, are you old enough or maybe you kind of um, have to deal with the situation of the one that got away, man? Because I'm dealing with that right now. And it sucks. I mean, I haven't seen this girl since, uh, I think, 2016. So when we broke up or I broke up with her and then like I saw her in 2017, I think briefly, if I remember correctly, but I haven't seen her since. And man, dude, I miss this girl. I miss everything that, you know, she was, you know, we weren't perfect, but damn, man, it sucks thinking about what could have been, you know, and man, life teaches you a lot of lessons. And I think what I grabbed from it is she taught me um, how to be self-aware and how to look in the mirror first. Because a lot of our relationship issues, I would blame on, you know, you know, her instead of looking inside and seeing, man, what am I contributing to the issue? And it was always her fault. And it was always like I couldn't see past my own insecurities to to work with her when everything and I, I fucked up big time and it was a huge look, growing lesson because when I tried to reconnect with her in 2017 it was yeah 2017 she was like I don't love you anymore and that shit fucking broke me and now I realize what I put her through when I broke up with her and so it's like it's crazy the person I, I am now than the person I was in, I'm a lot, a lot more considerate. I believe I'm a lot more considerate and I'm so open to growth and I'm so open to just growing with somebody instead of stepping on them and pointing out their flaws and, you know, trying to act like all my rules in a relationship were the rules that mattered instead of listening to her rules and her like growing with a person isn't making a person a carbon copy of yourself. It's growing with a fucking different person. And I think that's something us guys need to fucking learn. And girls too, honestly. Some of y'all too, I'm sure. But anyways, I just wanted to say, man, if you guys are going through the same issue that I am, thinking and kind of harping on the one that got away, just know, you know, hey, take the lesson from it. You know, I, <laughs> I'm, I think, she, I'm pretty sure she's happy now. Last time I saw her, um, I didn't say much to her. We like awkwardly ran into each other and I looked at her. She looked at me and it was like a second interaction and she just kept walking by and I respected it. I was like, you know what? I'm not going to bother her. You know, she was having fun. We we're both salsa dancers. So she was dancing. I was like, I'm going to leave her alone. But anyways, try to grab a lesson from the one that got away, y'all. Try to move on. Don't be the stalker. Don't be the one who keeps trying to come from her because you know what? You're still being selfish because you got to let her live now. It's not all about you. Same for girls. Hey, let him go. Let him live his life. You learn your lesson. You move on. You be better for the next person. All right. That's all I got to say. Peace. Motherfucker.